Hi guys. Uh, the handle on my tire hammer split. So we're going to move to something else and I'm going to take these two wheels down to uh, tire service in Tacoma uh, next week. And uh, So I'm going to put you right into the middle of the action here. And I'm going to pull all the head bolts off the head of the 170. It's going to be a little loud. No thermostat, that's not a good sign. But it may not be bad. Gotta love air tools. Yeah, see that? No thermostat. That might not be good. Okay, gonna continue on down the line here. Okay, so all the head bolts are out. Ooh, look at that. That little head comes right off. Little head. Anyway. There's the underside of the head. It could stand with a cleanup. A decarbonization. I'm going to turn the high. It's, it didn't have much compression when I turned it. And looks like all the valves do turn. So this is going to be a running, a good running engine. And I don't see any blow by between the pistons. So that indicates that this engine wasn't too badly damaged, or I should say not damaged at all. And the head gasket still is shiny. So I'm happy for $50. This is a very promising runner. Yep, the only valve I have in question is this exhaust valve on number one. But the valve seat is shiny. It's hard to see down in there. You can see that. Okay, come on, focus. There it is. You can see the shine right down in there. So yeah, I'm happy. This this is a good save. Or I should say a good find. This will go great in the weasel. So I'm gonna button it back up. Maybe I'll decarbonize it real fast with a wire wheel. Yeah, I'll do that and come back. Alright, thanks for watching.